I can't believe these words are about to come out of my mouth. What is going on, y'all? And welcome to my last ever week of college here at UNC Chapel Hill. There's so much stuff going on this week. I'm excited to take y'all along with me. It's gonna be bittersweet for sure, but no time to think about that because we gotta kick things off with this very chaotic Monday ahead. And that starts out with class. <laughs> class here in good old Curtis Media Center is the first part of this week. This is the only class I have on Monday, 12.30 to 1.45, and it is the capstone class that we're required to take as our final credit for my media and journalism major. All right, welcome to Media Hub. Um, it is the second to last day here. We have my wonderful team here. Yes, what's up, Say hi, Caitlin, Olivia. A very stressed Anna, but she's doing good work. Anna's got they've this. All been, they've all been killing it this semester. Okay, you know where I am. You probably think I'm tired of this place. After doing that 24-hour challenge, if you saw that. But, alas, we're back for a quick one-hour grind because I have a lot of work to do on um, Wednesday and Thursday. Thank you. You already know I had to acquire the Bojangles walking back to my car now. It is such a beautiful freaking day outside. It is like 62 degrees and sunny. I know absolutely no one cares, but I just would like to flex that I managed to secure the first parking spot out of the stairwell. Thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> The Union Bojangles is always hit or miss. Unfortunately, today is one of those missed days. <laughs> right, I have a small gap of time. I just really quickly finished editing my bell tower video from last week, and I'm working on the thumbnail and uploading it. <laughs> but I only have till five because at 5:30 we have another big part of the day, and this is one that basically every senior does at some point. I've had this date in my mind for like two months, but it is graduation photos. I have not been looking forward to this one because it means it's real. It's happening. Me and my friends have a shoot from 5:30 to 7:30. Heading to the old well now to get that done. I expected the old well has a uh, big line ahead of it. Old well done with location number two. Steps of Wilson. Location three. Turn away. The bell tower. Hi. Oh, it smells like straight prosecco out here. And the final location. You already know where I am. The most beautiful college football stadium in the U.S. Damn, I'm gonna miss this place. Well. In just under three weeks, I'll be back at the stadium in the same exact outfit. But for the real thing, that's insane. Here, shout out Nathan for hey. taking our photos. Hey. Like and subscribe. <laughs> but sorry for the bad lighting. If you notice, I'm still in my dress shirt tie out of the blazer because there's one other thing happening tonight. It's happening at Memorial Hall right now, and that is. The Rammies. Winner of the Rammy for the most outstanding female athlete. Talk is speedy spread. Come now. Shout out to Rammies. We are post Rammies right now with the whole Fever Squad. Yay! They got, they got free cold stone here. It's the last time seen all the athletes here. So for a little bit of context, if you have no idea what that was, the Rammies, obviously a spinoff of Grammys, is the annual exclusive award show that UNC puts on for all its student athletes. We get invited for being on the leadership board of Carolina Fever. Um, always really cool to see all the student athletes in one spot and meeting some of them afterwards. Shout out Aaron Matson. It is now 1 a.m. I just did like half my philosophy reading. Need to do the other half tomorrow before class. So I will see y'all tomorrow. Morning. We're starting this Tuesday off here at 11 a.m. for my philosophy and practical ethics class here in beautiful Caldwell Hall. Okay, quick pit stop back at home. I usually don't come home after class, but there are a couple things I need to grab for my next class, which my next two classes of the day, I have one at two and one at five, are a little unique. Let's just say that. Swimming is the class that I have at two an hour later and uh that is done with <laughs> little random of a class i know um it is not my outfit i took my outfit freshman year but i'm gonna drive home shower and then i'll explain why i took this okay so essentially i was taking 10 and a half credits of actual classes this semester but to get up to 12 i needed two more credits instead of finding one class to do it 
I decided to look at PHYAs, which are one credit physical activity classes. So I just chose two that looked interesting to learn or stuff that I want to get better at. And the first one was swimming. And the second one I am heading to right now, it's about 445. And that is squash class. Yeah, very random, I know. But it was offered and I was like, I've always kind of liked racket sports, so why not learn it? Good morning and happy Wednesday. <clears throat> Doing my cut through Keaton Stadium to get to my same 12.30 class again. And it's starting to set in that this is the final set of my Monday Wednesday classes. Some interesting ways of getting around campus. I'm rushing a little bit because characteristically for my second to last ever day of class. Sorry, at 12.30, it is 12.32. Maybe, yeah. I know, I was like, should I follow up because I'm not, like, you are juicy. Shout out my fellow PR person, MG. So unlike Mondays when that was my only class of the day, I do actually have two classes on Wednesdays um, because the other one is two and a half hours long. It's from 5 to 7.30. Um, so obviously that is way too much to be twice a week. So it's only once a week, this awkward three hour gap between them. And it's like, even though I really don't have anything to do on campus, I just feel like I wanna be here as long as possible because there's only two class days left where campus is active, the pit is active, and it's just nice to walk around. So in the spirit of that, I am heading somewhere that I have barely gone to this semester because I'm done with my minor, so I don't have any classes here. And that is the business school. Construction mode for the new building is in full swing. Whenever I come back in two years, I'm excited to see it. I've had some of the most productive uh, moments here in this cafe for whatever reason, which is weird because I don't really like the business school all that much in general. Right. 5 p.m. Welcome back to Curtis Media Center, the branding of me, aka Major 577. What you're going through is really inside of you. You have the ability to do that. Uh, all right, so that's a wrap up, Brady. Shout out to our professor, Gary K here. I love if you it. ever have the chance to take a class with him, go for it. It's a Please lot of like, do. freshman incoming students that watch my videos. Yeah. So yeah, thank you. Hope so to much see y'all in the future. Semester. It was Riley's last ever class as a, as a student. What the hell? Um, Riley and I just drove over like seven minutes to a very random location and that is UNC's softball stadium which is actually off campus. Softball is like in the middle of a game versus Charlotte right now. I don't really care that much but um, we were both Fever directors for the past three years as you all know and this is the last ever Fever game technically as a student. Softball! <laughs> oh! Catch please! Get there! Oh, yeah. Very sad that that is over. Fever has been a very big part of my college experience. But um, anyways, I just stopped at Target on the way back. Got some groceries because my apartment has been heavily lacking that recently. Um, and we'll see where the rest of the night goes. I have no idea right now, to be honest. <laughs> nothing. I ended up actually doing nothing last night. There are plans to go to like shooters and stuff because it's Duke Cell Doc, go to another friend's house. I just didn't have the energy for that, so yeah. Um, anyways, it is now Thursday, 11 a.m. I'm about to head into that philosophy class again. And as you all saw, the rest of my Thursdays have a very weird schedule with the two physical activity classes. So I think this is going to be my last traditional class ever, maybe, or definitely of UNC. Objectification? Yes, okay. <laughs> so basically, goodbye lecture halls at UNC. I made it back to Bojangles again I'm with Hi. Daughtry. This is kind of sad too because she was in my um, first day of college vlog and now she's in my last day of college Aww. vlog. That's so cute! Swimming. <laughs> a little one and a half hour gap I'm spending here at the UL. And squash. And if you would have told me my last ever class as a student at UNC would be on a squash court, 
I would not believe you. But yet, here we are. I almost dropped this class because it was 5 p.m. Tuesday, Thursday, and that's like such an atrocious time, but stuck through it, and it's been really fun. Oh, yeah. I'm currently refing <laughs> a game to the baddest today players. So. <laughs> we'll play the highlight real after. <laughs> While I wait to be called in for my next game, I'm just watching from this upstairs balcony they have and like, I would never know this existed. If I didn't take this class, it's not amazing, but it's pretty nice. Like, check this out. Video. And that's a wrap on the last ever class at UNC. Shout out my squash class. Hey, 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 hey. Good job. Damn. Alright, well that ran way too late, so now I need to wait one sec. Yeah. We have to go out the emergency exit so that happens every time. But anyway, now I have to like extreme rush to my next thing because I have to change for it and you'll see why in a sec. That was the least time I've said putting on a suit. It probably looks bad, but I have a formal to go to at 645. It's here, huh? It's really freaking here. I would say good morning, but it's like 1 o'clock right now. I slept in. It is officially LL Doc. The last L Doc. I don't have any classes on Friday, as I told y'all. So no reason for me to really go to campus, but I'm gonna go because it's L Doc. There's always stuff happening on the pit, on the quad. All my friends are going as well. Excited to check out the vibes and pretty sad too. That's what I like to see. The pit is bumping. The gray hole is popping too. <laughs> Shout out to my boy Arya. Says, hi. <laughs> he said hi to me on like the first day of class and now last day. Damn, bro. <laughs> We're having one last bottom of Lenore lunch. Even though we haven't done this all semester, this is the first time that we've done this. Okay, so <laughs> I got burrito bowl. I made my own. And these guys are all burrito bowl haters. They're terrible. His burrito bowl no, 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 sucks. We, we love burrito bowls. <laughs> His this is, is not a burrito, burrito bowl. You hate that you hate that place over there. Tell tell the idiots. I think it's always been overhated. Chilling on the Wilson steps now, right into Neil. Yo. He was in my vlog for the last day of high school and now we're on the last day of college. Oh wait, that's crazy. I didn't even think yeah. about it like that. Yeah. Hey, you still got two years though. I you're know, chilling. but like these two years went by so fast. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like we're two years apart and we always catch each other at each milestone. True. But I haven't really gotten the chance to explore much of Wilson's library's archives, so what better time than the last day? It's really neat actually. I recommend going here at least once. <laughs> <laughs> that camera's gonna win on to the next part of LDOC festivities. This is with the Business Society Club uh, that I've been in for two years here at UNC Scale and Coin. And that is like the annual LDOC darty kind of thing that they have every LDOC to kind of send off the seniors. Shout out to a future camera person, Gabby. Yeah. What, the I'm next clip is about to be by her. Shiv and C! Shiv and C! To be a part of a group like that, especially if you're a freshman, like, be grateful for that. One, enjoy every freaking moment, even the stress. I know that's so much easier said than done. Skip a scale event to make a YouTube video, but who said you can't do both? So, everyone say what's up. Shout out to Scalar Coin. Everyone back there. This is crazy. For the final part of this vlog, it's L Doc night, so how's it going, Frank? Shout out Nick, invited again. Uh, where are you now?